We've got linebacker Kamu Gruje Hill with us. It's good to see you, Kamu. And after an 18 tackle day, mm -hmm. we got to start there. Are you a little bit sorer than normal? How do you feel physically after that happens? Because that's what you had 18 tackles against the Colts. Yeah, you know, I think it was more, you know, in the preseason, you get 19, 20 plays maybe, and then to go to 92 <sighs> plays on the first, on the first yeah. one in the overtime game. Uh, division game, too. I mean, it was, we're feeling it for sure. But, um, yeah. you know, we're bouncing back. We're doing, uh, the things we need to do, uh, get ready for this week. Yeah, you say bouncing back. Ties, not fun. Nobody loves a tie. Mm -hmm. I know you guys always want to win. But Lovey Smith said it. Many others have said it. I think you probably even said it. There were positives to build on from mm -hmm. that game. What were some of those positives? What are, what are you taking into week two, those positives? I think, you know, just getting into a, a good start, right? We were up 20-3. to three. Um, I think we were playing some good defense. I think we were playing some good offense for a majority of that game. Um, I think the things we got built off of is just finishing now, right? Yeah. You know, you get in the, those time, those times. It's, it's times where you need to step on the gas, right? And and don't let you can't let a team come back like that. Um, so, um, building off those 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 points of the game and and just being able to finish games. Yeah, I think anybody that's watched this team uh, in training camp in the preseason watched last year's team, this is a better team. How is the defense yeah. better in that regard? And, and after what you've seen in week one, how is the defense better? I think just uh, everyone's a little more comfortable, right? I've said that multiple times. I think uh, guys know where they're going. Uh, guys are more bought in. Um, guys know where, you know, the weaknesses and the strengths of every defense and, and the calls and all that stuff. So, um, you know, just being able to grow on that too is, is going to be another step we need, we need to hit. Yeah. Okay, looking, to looking ahead to the Broncos – Mm -hmm. This is a rugged ground attack. Last last week was a rugged ground mm -hmm. attack, but the Broncos, that's a tough, mm -hmm. salty group on the ground. What's the challenge there? Offensive line, the backs in the run game for you. I think the backs run hard, you know. Uh, they got a big offensive line, you know, and they're like uh, maulers across the board, and um, backs run hard. I think that's just, uh, you know, the main thing. And stopping the run game is, you know, I think that's the key to every week, right? Everyone always asks that, well, what's the key to this week? And, um, I think in, in football, just one one is stop the run yeah. and manage the big plays. No doubt. Okay, I looked it up, and with the Eagles, with the Dolphins, now with the Texans, as a whole, you've played against a Russell Wilson quarterback mm -hmm. offense five times. Mm -hmm. What's the challenge with this guy yeah. as a quarterback? Because it doesn't matter who he's playing for. Mm -hmm. it, he's a good one. With him, the play is never over, right? You can, like I said this the other day, is when you're playing pocket passers and – you know, things are sometimes on a timing, right? You can you can kind of know when the play is about to be over or when he needs to get the ball out. Uh, with Russ, the play is never over, and um, you got to play whistle to whistle. You got to plaster to your guys, and just um, you got to cover everything. You like playing at NRG Stadium, but you like going on the road mm -hmm. as well. There's a little bit of a kind of the us against the world, quote unquote, mentality. What do you like the most about hitting the road? I like you know what you just said right there. I feel like going to a different stadium sometimes and getting booed at and. And, you know, just being in that hostile environment kind of brings the best out of out of some people. So um, being able to play in those those environments are, are, are fun. And what do you know about Denver? You you played there, but uh -huh. it was during the pandemic, yeah. the 2020 seasons. Yeah. What are you looking forward to most? I heard it's, you know, it's uh, it gets rowdy in there. You know, the, you know, the way the stadium is built, too, it's a little – they're a little closer to you so the fans can kind of talk to you a little more. And, um, you know, it's loud. And um, it's going to be their first home game. So it's going to be it's going to be fun. All right. Kamu Gruje Hill and the Texans – Looking forward to uh, picking up a win. Hope it starts this weekend. Best yeah. of luck to you, my friend. Thank you. Appreciate it. Thanks for watching. Subscribe to our channel and ring the bell to know when we post new content.